Hello, welcome to RTC TV4. My name is Gion Ritzler here with Dakota Hayden in Fulton, Indiana here at the Casting Crater. Getting ready for an exciting evening of high school football. It is Friday the 19th and tonight's matchup is between the Casting Comets and the Triton Trojans. They're about to get everything started here as we prepare for the kickoff. Yeah, welcome everybody. Some key players to keep an eye out for tonight is uh, number 44, Zach Slocum, as playing as a tight end. We got number 53, Trenton Howard. Going, um, what is Trenton Howard going for, Galen? I think he is the lineman. 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 Love it. You see, I'm all new to all this position thing, so Same it's here. it's figuring this out is going to be one heck of a trip. I think one player to look out for is Hunter Shalob, number 82. He will be the cast in tight end. He's a freshman, big kid, strong kid. I think he's going to be pretty good for the Comets here. Oh, yeah. Starting off, it's going to be a real interesting season. Here we go, the comments are about to kick off here. Got a nice gathering of crowd, everyone's pumped, here we go. Almost looks like a squid kick there. Trying to get the ball at the 35 yard line. Comments recover the football. Comments oh, recover. Comments got recovered. All right. Let's get the ball. Here we go. This is such a good start for the Comets. Comets so they got to do is start pushing them back now. And the starting quarterback for the Comets is Brady Hartman. He is a junior. First time starter for the Comets here. Pretty interesting to see what he can do to get this crew started as first home opener game. Brady Hartman, quarterback for the Gunners. There we go, scramble. A little scramble right there. A little. I think tonight you're going to see a lot of running game. You're not going to see too much run uh, passing this game. I agree. Sutton Tate Cowell coming in from the sideline. He's a split in for the Gunners. Smith, center, went out of there. And here we go as the comments about to hike the ball. Here we go. Hand off to the hand off. Hand off. Oh. Ooh. It's put down. I would say about 35 yard line right there. When to see where the ball gets placed. 39 yard line. 39 yard line. It is second down for the Comets, and we have 12 yards to go. It's up for first down. Yep, suffered a five yard penalty for uh, illegal, something illegal. Shift. Illegal, Illegal shift. Hand off the e friend. Ooh. And he got backed up. It was looking good. He got stopped. Third down and 10 for the comps to go here. Let's see what they can do here. Hand off. He's going. Ooh. Flag. Penalty flag on the field. Let's see what the call is. Well, actually, you'll see what the call is. This window's blocking my view. We'll see what the penalty is all about. Personal foul, face mask against the face Trojans. Mask against the Trojans. Fifteen yard walk off takes the football down to the sixteen yard line. 
And it's just first down. First down for the Cardinals. They're on a roll here. One more final push to get down to the to the end zone. Hand, fake handoff. That's oh interception. Ah. And the Trojans take ball. We have number 54, Wesley York, number 66, Roger Flint, and 35, Colton Welker coming in to play defense. Tritons are going to have a hard time getting past Roger Flint. He's a big boy. He's a stone wall. They ain't going to get through him. We got number seven, Tate Cow as the safety. Trones, oh, almost. Just a little bit, if you would have. And then a second down for the Trojans here. Let's see if the Comets can stop him here. Second down. And we're hoping so. Here we go. Looks like the Comets are in a shotgun again. Here we go. Get him. Oh, from. And he's going back. Is it back. Back. Getting through. And brings him down. Loss of yards right there. Nice. Nice. 54, Wesley York on the top of the Comets. Such a good defensive play right there by Roger Flint. Nine-yard Third down for the Trojans. Third down for Trojans. They've been pushed back. Let's 19 hope the yards Comets, to go here. Comets can keep them back from getting a first down. This will be a good play if the Comets can stop them here and get the ball back. And we do have a pretty good crowd here at the crater. Oh, yeah. Stands are... Just about Good packed, what I can see. They're putting the ball on the five yard line for the Trojans. This is going to be 23 yards to go for the first down. I'm guessing they're going to go in a shotgun play here for pass. Deep pass here. It's their only shot. And here we go. Oh, handoff. Shotgun handoff. And he is down. He is stopped. All right. All right. And most likely, they'll probably punt the ball here. What do you say here, Dakota? Oh, I'm thinking so. What else do they got? Yeah, it'll be pretty crazy if they go for on that. fourth down with 23 yards to go. Because, I mean, if they turn over, they're going to be... I mean, Cassie's going to be right in scoring either position, so. Yeah, either way. Yeah. Fourth down for the Trojans. Football's in about the six-yard line. Six-yard line here. They are punting the ball off to the Comets. Punts. Pretty good punt. And they are going to let it bounce. And touch at the 30. At the 38 yard line. Comets take ball. Here we go. First down. All right. Let's see what they can do this time. Hopefully, we can get them pushed back enough for a touchdown. This is Coach Brady Jones' second year here at Caston. Handoff. There we go. Ooh. Looks like he got tripped up. Number 40, Casey Alt. Casey Alt drives the ball hard. He runs the ball hard. <laughs> Number 12, Zach Conrad, first year here. First time player. Junior. Conrad is right receiver spot, number 12. 
Hey, don't forget, KCO. Oof. KCO is just pushing, pushing through there. Pushing through there. We got 30 yard line. Five yards to go. Third down. Third down for the Oh, my bad. Three yards to go. Three yards to go. <laughs> I'm looking for maybe a short pass here. Short pass to tight end Hunter Shalob. Ooh, what a hard hit. They got him on that one. Stopped him right there. Fourth down with four yards to go. I mean, honestly, Dakota, what would you do in this situation? Would you punt the ball over? Or, I mean, you're pretty close, honestly. I mean, if you punt it, I don't know who their punter is for casting. I don't know, but I'm all about taking risks. Yeah, I, I think I'd go and run it for those six it, yards. Yeah. Looks like they are going for it here. Here we go. Pass. Here we go. Here we go. Takes off running. Brady Hartman. Oh. And it's first. Hartman on It's, it's, close to the it's gonna be pretty close here. Let's see where they mark it at. Oh. Here goes the chain gang. It's a comet. First down. First, First down, down for the comets. What a run by Brady, getting us that first down to make room to get into the end zone. And more people continue to fill up, continue to walk in here at the casting crater. It's all. It's always good to see support. Oh yeah, always. Hand off, hand off. Ooh. Casey, a second time starter for varsity. He is a running back. You can also see him maybe at the quarterback too. Take it down with seven yards to go here for the Comets. Ooh, and they try the. Is that a quarterback sneak, Dakota? I can't tell, Galen. I can't see past can't this see. window. I'm trying my best, but. It's a nice press box we got sitting in here, but yeah. only so much view. Can you see pretty good now or scoot over a little bit? Oh, yeah, I can get it now. All right. And we'll be back right after this one minute break. And here we are back. Third down to go, six yards. Third down, six yards to go here for the Comets. And we got played through that entire little break there by the Comet band. Man, this, this would be so, so, so huge if they get a first down here. Uh, oh, in trouble, in trouble, Cole Brady. Here we go. Hartman trying to get past, got past. Oh, what a hit. Got through a little bit. Let's see where they mark the ball here. I'll say. Okay. 
About a yard on the play. Conrad and Tate Cal sub in and out for defense. I've noticed that throughout. Comes out, takes a break. Yeah. <laughs> Fourth down here with six six yards to go here. Looks like they're going to fake it. Fake handoff. Look at the pass. Goes for the pass. Goes for. Casey, oh! Casey got the, the first down. That was a really good play by the Comets right there. Good fake handoff, faked off, went off to the left side. That's all number 40, Casey All for the first down. What a catch by Casey All. Football at the 80 yard line. Ball is on the eight yard line. Handoff, Efren and Mosquito. I'll tell you, he picked up two good yards right there. Oh, yeah. Mosquito on the carry. It's down to the five yard line. Yep. Second and goal to go from the five for the Comets. Come on, Comet fans, let's hear a little noise out there. Let's help them out. Let them know you're up here. Let them know you're behind them. The fans getting riled up around here as they go to Second approach down the down for the game. Comets here. We've got five yards to go here. Handoff to Casey Alt. Casey Alt gets in. It is touchdown! Touchdown, Comets! Touchdown, Comets! And there we have it. First... First score of the game by the Comets, handoff. It was such a good, great play. We had the, go to, we had that great pass by Hartman to find Casey All in the corner over by the left side. Yep, Casey's been making some pretty good plays. I said that was the huge compact play that started this drive on that third down. And they are going for two. Hands off to Efren and Mosquito, and I believe he is short. 21, Efren and Mosquito on the carry, and he's short. No good, no, no good, good, no four. good. Comet six, Trojan zero. That's all right, that's all right. Great start for the Comets here. As we Let's can see. hear out in the crowd, the band celebrating that we got a touchdown, as they well should be. Keep that up, we can pull it and win. They're huddling up, getting ready to go back out and kick it off to the Trojans here. Getting the ball, set it down here. Getting their line up. And I'm most surprised to see what they'll do this time. If they'll actually kick it off. They're gonna, or they're gonna go for that squid kick. What do you think here, Dakota? I don't know. I think they're gonna actually go to kick it off. And if they do, what I've heard, Roger Flint, number 66, he's pretty good at kicking that ball off. Really? Yep. And it looks like that's what they're gonna do. Ooh. What grade is Roger Flint? He's a senior. Senior, okay. I do believe this is his perhaps first year playing. First year playing. Yeah. Well, there we Pretty go. Pretty good kick here. That's a good kick. Triton catches it. Try, uh, stop him. Stops him at the uh, 49 yard line. 53, Trent Howard on the stop for the Comets. 
Here we go as the Comets play defense here. And here we go as Trojans have ball, about to hike the ball. Looks like they're in shotgun here. Going for a pass. Here we go. Pass is complete. Ooh, what a hit. Had a way to get him. Fumble. I think he was already down. I think. I think. It looked like he was down. I think he was. 35, Colt Walker on the hit for the Comets. Colt Walker got that. Pass was complete. Pretty good hit by Phoenix Singleton, senior. Second down, Trojans football at the 44 yard line. There we go, second down to go, four yards to go. Let's see if the Comets can stop him here and force third down. And shotgun play again. Hand off. And tried to sneak him Stop through. There ah. we go. Like 53, Trenton Howard got him down for that one. I think it may be a first down for the Trojans. Let's see how far they made it. Yes, yeah, first down. First, first down here. And here we go. First down with 10 yards to go. Flag. Legs all over the place. I think that is a false start by the. That is against the Trojans. They'll go back to five yards to make it 15 yards to go here. And that'll play to the advantage of the Comets. It sure will. And that backs them back to the. About, I would say, 45 yard line, maybe. Let's see, where's the ball plays? Okay, it's about. Okay. Give him a little room to breathe as we go into the next play here. First down with 15 to go here. Let's see if the comments can stop him here. Ooh. Oh. And drops it. Incomplete. Incomplete. Pass. Incomplete. We force second down here with 15 yards to go. I have to say the Castings defense is doing pretty good. Pretty solid. Oh yeah. Pretty solid start here. Mark Smith. Mark Smith coming off number 60. Big kid. Sophomore. Big key for the comments on defense and on offense. Mm-hmm. And a flag. Flag here. placed. Penalty flag here, about the 44 yard line. Holding against the Trojans. Holding against the Trojans. Trojans are just playing a little bit dirty tonight. And here we go. And it is still, what is it, first down, second down? Uh, so still first, what would that be? First down first and down. First down at 20? Yeah. Yeah. First down at 20 here. Still. Ball goes back to the 36 yard line here for the Trojans. Let's see if the Comets can stop him here. Comets got plenty of room to breathe here. Just got to keep pushing them back. Yep. Here we have it. Yeah. Looks deep. Looks deep. Interception. Interception, Interception. by Casey Ault. What a great play by Casey Ault. Just reading the ball out of his hands and going to go get that ball. Nice play by Casey Ault. No, the Comets will have it first and 10 on the 25-yard line, I'd say. Yeah, I'd say a route by there. Casey Ault making a number of good plays today, gaining yards oh, for us. Oh, yes. 
and intercepting that, that's going to be a great play for us. Tate Coward, number seven, comes in. And he plays the tight end. Tight end. Here we go as the Comets, first down 10, ball on the 25 yard line. Looking for that fake handoff pass again, and he's taking off running Hartman. Here we go. Ooh. Hartman, number 20 on the quarterback keeper around the left side, is knocked out of bounds by number 50, Adam Stevens for the Trojans. Not before he gains about six yards on the carry. People continue to fill in the crater here at Caston. There's no shortage of supporter here for the comments tonight. Oh, yes. Always good. Always good. Timeout on the field called by the comments. Timeout on the field called by the <laughs> comments here. <laughs> All the way to medium. Mm -hmm. And here we are back. Casting have ball on the 32 yard line. Five yards to go. Second down for the Comets. And I'm thinking this is a totally makeable play for the Comets, so hopefully they can get us in yeah. for another first down. For sure, for sure. Here we go here. And here we have it. Second down, five yards to go for the Comets. Handoff, play the KC Alt. KC Alt running in for uh, the yards. I'd say he maybe picked up one or two there. It's looking like a one yard gain for the ball being on the 33 yard line. Three yards to go for the Comets here on third down. Third down for the Comets. Here we go. Flag. Flag is called. I think that is a false, false start against the Comets here. And now with the ball will be on the 38 yard line. Third down they go. I mean, ball on the 38. Eight. Eight yards to go. Eight yards to go. There you go. 28. Uh, ball on the 28 yard line here. We got a minute left for this corner, less than a minute yeah, left for Eight this yards quarter. to go, third down here. Let's see if he can pull off one of those passes like he did the last last run. There we go. In off, off the KCO. Oh, getting KC through. running for yards. Ooh. He's fighting right through there in the middle. Fourth down here go. One, one, yard one yard to go for the comments here. Fourth and one. I mean, I think their only shot, Dakota, is honestly just, just run it right up the middle. Yeah, just push for it, get that first down, and start up with the new fresh and downs here. No, it looks like they decided to run that out the clock. That is the end of the first quarter here. 
Comets lead the Trojans 6-0. And thank you for turning, tuning in to RTC TV. We will we'll be back after this short break. And here we go, it's fourth down with one yard to go, ball on the 35 yard line for the Comets. Wait. Yes. Fourth and one. Fourth and one. Fourth and one here for the Comets. Let's see what they can do here. Hand off there we to go. Casey. Hand oh, off. big run there. First down for the Comets. Nice run by Casey. He is being, he is unstoppable this game so far. First down. Zach Conrad goes back into the game. And here we go. Starting off again. I would say false start by the comments here. And it will be first down to 15 yards to go. Ball on the 43 yard line here for the comments. Tad bit of a hindrance, but nothing that the comments can't come back from. And Conrad comes right back out of the game, and Tate Cow goes in. Noticed a lot of swapping between those two. I wonder yes. what they got planned up. The Tate plays wide receiver, so they might be going for a really long pass here. Maybe. I haven't really seen Hunter Shalob, number 82, yet in the tight end. I cannot find him. Hmm. Well, we got number 44, Zach Slocum, down there, and I know he plays tight end, so they might have a hunter on standby in case yeah. Zach needs to get called out. So ball on the 48-yard line now, second down with 10 to go here. It's actually first down for the Comets and then 10 yards to go. Ball on the 48-yard line here. Hand off play to number 35, Wesley York. Pretty good pickup. Colton Walker, right my bad. Colton Walker. That's a pretty good pickup right there. Yeah. Second down with eight yards to go here for the Comets. Second down for the Comets. Is that Conrad getting put back into play? I think he's getting a little conditioning work in here going back and forth. What do you think? I'm thinking so too. I haven't seen him effectively used <laughs> so far yet. 
He is set up to play a substitute quarterback if needed, but I don't think I think he has yet to be put in to actually fill in that position. He's filling out to the right receiver spot here. False start. False start. Penalty, penalty on the comments here. Now mark them back to the 40, 47 yard line. Second down with 15 to go here. Comments getting a little bit too eager for their own good. They better be careful. Yes. There we go. See what Brady Hartman can do right here. Hand off, Hand off to Casey. Casey. Oh, Casey oh, takes a big, through. big, huge chunk of run right there. It is third down for the Comets. Five yards to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. Casey all just tearing through and carrying the Comets practically at this point. Yes. He's not that big, but I mean, he runs the ball hard for how little he is. Oh yeah. It looks like he got a haircut too. He did have some kind of mullet. Yeah, he had. He had a long hair. He had. A, yeah, his hair was pretty long, longer than mine almost. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it definitely was longer than mine. He but cut it like what two days ago? Something like that. Had a pretty good flow of hair going. Oh yeah. I think he might have been scared of the opponent team maybe pulling on it. What do you say? <laughs> oh yeah, that definitely be I know a threat be, there. Be one of my fears. <laughs> oh yeah. 58 Parker again on the bottom of the pile. What is it? Fourth down. We got fourth down here with one yard to go, and ball in the 43 yard line. Fourth down in inches. Fourth down in comments. inches here for the comments. <laughs> comments are huddled up. Looks like. Got an official officials timeout the here on the field. I honestly do not know what is going on here. Splitting up the teams. And we will be back here as they see where the ball lines up. Thanks for tuning in to RTC TV 4. And it looks like they marked the ball two yards short from the first down yard line. Fourth down and two inches for the Comets here. Comets real close at this point. Here we go. Looks like a quarterback sneak maybe here. Pushing up there, keep pushing. Quarterback gets it up to the 40-yard line. Gets it up to the 40-yard line down. here. And first first down, down for the Commons. What a great quarterback sneak there. Effective play there by the Commons. And here we go. First down with 10 yards to go, ball on the 40 yard line. Handoff play to Ephraim and Mosquito. Ephraim takes up the middle. And a yeah, stop. I don't think he got anything on that one. Kind of a no gain there. Second down comments. Comments are huddled up, figuring out what they're going to do here. Second down, 10 yards to go, ball in the 40. They got to keep going right at them with the ball. I think Casey is really good running the ball offensively. I think he's really strong. It looks like they're going, ooh, oh, oh, oh. Ah. 
I don't think that was a too smart of a play by Coach Brady Jones with that toss. What do you think, Dakota? I'm not thinking so. I mean, I think you had Casey right behind, and then Brady just turned around. I don't think that was honestly the right play for the comments in that situation. No, honestly, I think they should have run Casey. He's been a really yeah. valuable asset so I know, far. I know you game. can't outdo Casey, but I mean, I think that was the wrong play to go with. Mm hmm. And Trojans have the ball on the 47 yard line. Shotgun here. Going for the pass. They're looking there deep. We go. Nope, short. And he catches Complete. it. He is down on the. It's <laughs> a good stop, though, by number 52. Phoenix Singleton with the stop for the Comets there. Ball across the 50 yard line at the 48. Second down for the Trojans. The Comets have 26 players on their roster. I mean, they're mostly playing both positions. So, I mean, they're going to have to hand in there and keep their uh, consistency consistent up. Oh, deep play. Uh, here Ooh. we go. Snyder's pass is incomplete. That pass is incomplete. It'll be third down for the Trojans with six yards to go. Ball on the 40 yard, 48 yard line. The Comets forming a plan on how they're going to keep back the Trojans. Number 77, Chris Smith gets put into play. Let's see if the Comets can stop them here, Dakota. Let's hope so. I mean, the Com Comets defense has been pretty, I'm pretty impressed with their defense so far. Hand off. Oh, fake hit. Steps. And I think he has stopped short, probably. Seven, James Snyder. He's a couple of the Comets. What do you think? Do you think they got it there, Dakota? I think they might have got at least. First shot. Was it first? Fourth. I think it's fourth down. Fourth down. Fourth down for the Trojans. Maybe about one or two inch, maybe inches to go here. And I know they'll probably go for it. Looks like they are. Definitely. They've been almost in the shotgun play the whole game the Trojans have. They've been throwing all passes and yeah. the comments have been going for all runs. Let's see which one fares better here. Looking, here looking we deep. Oh, wide open. Ah. He dropped it. Incomplete. 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 So it turns over Turn back to the Comets. Turn on down. It's Comets ball here on the 47-yard line. Here we go. Oh, no. Here we go. We got a penalty now. Let's see what this is all about here. What are they going to call? An ineligible receiver downfield to go on the Trojans. And the penalty is declined by the Comets, and the Comets take over the football. Comets 47 yard line. Still Comets ball on the 47 yard line. Let's see, we got. Is that Blake Albright in the running back position? I think that is. Hands off to yep. Blake. Here we go. Blake is a fast kid. Oh, yeah. Number eight, Blake Albright on the carry. I'll tell you, he got brought, what, maybe two, three yards on that one. Looks about like it. Gains two yards on the play. Gets it up to the yep. Yeah, it's two yards on the play. Second down, comments. Second down for the comments with eight yards to go. Let's see what they can do here. As you can see, Conrad is back into the game. He's been playing that right receiver spot. I haven't seen him get any action yet. Yeah, it's interesting. I mean, he's a pretty tall kid, 6'1", 6'2". Actually, pretty linky and skinny. He's fast. It looks like too. they handed the ball to Blake Albright. Oh, fumble. Ball. 
Was it recovered? Fumbles the ball and rolls out of bounds. Nope, balls out of bounds. Albright fumbles the ball and it runs out of bounds. Third down for the Comets. Third down for the Five yards to go. And Tate Cow comes back in to the game for Conrad here. Tate Cow looks like he is out on the right receiver spot. Which is pretty interesting. They seem to be swapping up that wide yeah. receiver spot quite often. Looks like Blake Albright going in Ooh, for again. Good run. Great. Blake Albright on the carry again. Gets it across the 45 to the 44 yard line. Be fourth down for the Comets. Fourth down for the Comets with one yard to go. Yard to Ball on the 44 yard line. They are close. Yeah, that was a good running for Albright coming in, just running a couple times. I think that was good. Mm hmm. It was a good change for the Comets right there in that position. Offensive right there. Put in the yards where it counts. It looks like they got Casey back yeah. into play and replace Casey, Albright. Give Casey a little break and have him get going again. There you go, hand off to Casey. Yeah. Uh, he was stopped. I think he might have got, I don't know, that's gonna be close Casey for the Comets. On the carry. He stopped at the 44 yard line. Trojans have held the Comets, and the Trojans will take over the football. Oh, turnover on downs. Trojans ball here on the 44-yard line. As you can see, Trojans are back up in that shotgun position. Let's see what they will do here. Ooh, ooh, get him! Oh, oh, spin! They got Gets him down. Oh, he's getting back. He's oh, he tried to go through. He's down. That was good. Heads up by the Comets, just attacking him right in the middle, coming through, making sure to keep him down. Seven, Tate Cowell comes up off the bottom of the pile on the stop for the Comets. Second down, Trojans gained a half a yard on that play. Second and ten to go for the Trojans here. <laughs> Timeout on the field, called by the Trojans. Tro Timeout on the time field, out. called by the Trojans. All right, we're getting started back off again. Trojans have the ball. Such a beautiful night here at the Casting Crater. I know in the forecast there's supposed to be 
There's supposed to be rain, but it, luckily for us, it's turned out to be such a beautiful night here. Yeah, such clear skies, no rain in sight. It's about 79 degrees. Beautiful night for a football game. And the Comets still lead the game 6-0. The assistant coaches for the Comets is Marcus K, Tony Slocum, and Rusty Newby. And for the managers, you got Lessa Hubenthal, Lexi McClory, Kane, Shay Lob, Kane Shane Lobb, and Nolan Fields. They give you guys a little pass of Brady Jones, head coach for the Comets. He was a pretty outstanding football player at Lewis Cass High School. And then he went on to play at Manchester University Division Three football and got his degree in teaching, I believe. It might have been. This is all new stuff to me. And Galen, I didn't know you knew so much about Brady. And then this is his second year coaching here at Caston. He's doing a pretty good job last year. Unfortunately, it wasn't the way he wanted to go, mm -mm, not which, I mean, that happens sometimes. But I think this year might be a better year for the Comets. Oh, yeah. We've seen a lot of improvement so far this year. They've been working hard over the summer. Keston, they got a new weight room, which is huge for the Comets. A lot more space to work out, new equipment. Second down for the Trojans. I mean, they almost look like giants out there. Yeah. Maybe the little giants. Nah. Nah. Oh, deep pass by the Trojans. Ah, incomplete. Incomplete pass by the Trojans. Number 44, Zach Slocum was subbed out. I didn't catch who he was subbed out for, but he's been getting a lot of playing time so far today. And I would want to think that that might be because his dad, Tony Slocum, is playing as an assistant coach. But I don't know. And Blake Albright's coming back into the game. I'm looking for, looks like he's filling out to the tight end spot. Maybe, nope, out to the right receiver. Interesting maneuver play. Wait, no, he is guard. He is yeah, guard. guard. Yeah, wait. <laughs> he is guarding the right receiver spot. They're going for another pass. Ooh. It was complete. And I would say they probably they probably got, I think, three yards on the play. Yeah, looks about like it. Like I said earlier, my name is Gail Rensselaer and here with Dakota Hayden. We are currently seniors at Caston. The RTC for TV, they are looking for Caston students to fill in and help film all the sports at Caston. And we decided to be on the film crew for a great opportunity for us to learn new skills and to get paid also. Yeah, that's always a plus. It gives us great opportunities to commentate for great games like tonight, as well as go and travel with the teams and film them to show off on Channel 4 on RTC. So I'd like to thank RTC TV for giving us this opportunity and letting us do it. We're real grateful for it. And the big raffle down there this evening will read us if time permits or at the half. We got one minute and 36 seconds before halftime here. Take it down to the go. Looks, oh, almost interception by Singleton and broken up by Singleton. Phoenix Singleton. He's been pretty good on the defense line. Defensive line. Mm -hmm. Pretty darn good by Singleton. Third and ten for the Tritons here, for the Trojans. Excuse me on that one. The Comet's got a minute 31 to keep them back or hopefully swap them on downs, but we'll find out. Here we go Short pass. pass. Gotta stop him. Gotta stop him. Get him down. He... That pass is complete by Fletcher for the Trojans. That was a big stop by 
Trent Howard, senior. Uh, I think he's a uh, 34-time varsity starter. Pretty little for his size, but he's good. Good, good, good. Defender guy out there. Real nice guy in person, too, that trend. Yes. He's a ginger, too. Mm -hmm. I, I call him the ginger milkshake. The ginger milkshake. Ginger milkshake. So you guys can look out for Trent Howard, number 53, 5'8". Um, he's 5'8", weighs 165. I mean, not that big of a kid, but I mean, he gets the job done on he the defense does. end. Very effective, very effective. Thanks for tuning back in with us. Here we go. Penalty flag was placed. I think they're calling it against Triton. Illegal procedure against the Trojans. Backs them up five yards. Backs the Trojans up by five yards, and that would be 10 to go with fourth down. I mean, I don't know what's best. I think maybe punt it off. You would, you would think that's... Yeah. yeah. Let's see what they try and pull off here as we get that to the end be, of the That would quarter. honestly be the smart move, but you just never know in high school football, honestly. No. Doesn't look like it. You see Trent Howard, he goes back and forth. Looks like he's ready to go. Here we go. Oh, oh missed for. him. That's a deep pass. Ah. Niger's pass is incomplete. That pass was incomplete. Turnover on downs. Comets got the ball. Comets will take over the ball on the 35-yard line. Pretty good in pretty good position, honestly, mm -hmm. for the Comets. Got a minute and five to go on the second quarter. Let's see if we can score another touchdown before it ends. Looks like people are getting up and getting stuff at the concessions before halftime, before it gets really busy. Oh, yeah. People are getting smarter these days. Uh -huh. <laughs> what do you say? Oh, yeah, that crowd gets really big around halftime down there at concessions. I know I've worked in the concessions a couple times for my baseball team. And let me tell you, it's busy. Oh, yeah. Nonstop working, getting breadsticks ready, nachos ready. Oh, yeah. But I'll have to say they have probably one of the best concession stands in Class 1A football. Definitely, I have to agree. The food's really good. And I guess it also helps working concessions to also get to mooch off of free goodies every oh, now and then. Yeah. Half a minute left to go with the comments. We go give it to Casey. Casey, big run. First down, Comets. First down! First down for the Comets on the 49, 49 yard line. Tate Cal comes back into the, to the game and he'll probably fill out to the right receiver spot. I'd imagine. Yep, he's filling out. Almost an empty position since I don't think we've gone for too many pass runs here. For too many passes here. We got here. KC all. Um, I'm guessing they're, they're, uh, they're going to maybe run the ball here. And it's halftime. Half Thanks for tuning in to RTC TV for the second half. We will be back here shortly after the five-minute break. 
I think it is a five minute break. Is that what it is? Five or 15. I think it's 15. 15. We'll be back after halftime. And thanks for tuning in. We will be back. Thank you. All right, welcome back to RTC TV. We're getting just done with the break right now, and we're about ready to get started up again. We got a couple of scores for you here at halftime. Logan in support 12, Peru 6. Another game, Pioneer and Lewis Cash game, Pioneer 41, Lewis Cash 0. Over the course of halftime, we heard Pioneer, Caston's longtime rivals, got 41 to nothing on Lewis Cass down playing tonight, right now. So it should be an interesting matchup when the Comets end up clashing head to head with Pioneer in the near future. Getting ready here to. Prepare for the kickoff as the Comets will return. Trojans lined up and ready to go. Or Zach Pitney will. Kickoff for the Trojans. Deep for the comments is Casey Alt. Ooh, good, good. That's a good kick. That's a good kick oh. by the Trojans. Oh, he gets up to the 30, 30, 32 yard line. On the return, it's across the 30 to the 31 yard line where the comments will start first and 10. Looks like we got a holding there. Penalty flag on the field. We got a holding call against the Comets. Holding flag against the Comets. Looks like they're going to back it up. Ball on the. They're going to back it up 15 yards. They're going to back it up 15 yards. First and 10. From the 17 yard line. <laughs> That's not going to be too good of a start there, but... They're going to have to work their way up slowly as they get up there. Comets will start first and ten. Comets will start first and ten here on the 17-yard line. First down, ten to go. Handoff play to Casey Alt. What a good run. Casey Alt on the run. Stop by number nine, Ty Orson. Seems like the little... Halftime break in between the first half and the second half hasn't stopped Casey at all. See if he can run in for more yards. Handoff play to Ephraim and Mosquito. Ephraim gets a good chunk of yards right there. It's a good push by Ephraim. That'll be first, first down, close to the 30 yard line. First down for the Comets here. Here we go, Comets working our way to the end zone. I do have to say the yard doing pretty darn solid on the offensive end too, as well as defense. Oh, easily. The Comets' offensive line has definitely improved since last year. Handoff play to Casey Alt. Uh, I would say he got maybe one, two, year, two yards there. Trojans seem to be figuring out that Casey is definitely a key oh, asset okay. here. Conrad comes yards. back out of the game. In a yard on the play, second down Comets. Casey Alt's coming back in. Take Cal is in. <clears throat> oh, Ooh, a good run right there. Now we'll go down to third down. 40 
Casey Alden to carry again. It's across the 35 yard line to the 36. Nine yards to go, third, third down. down. Five yards to go. Five yards to go. Five. Third down. See what they can do here. Third down with five to go. Ball on the 36 yard line. Hand off play. Good spin, Moon. Nice. There we go. I would say he uh, he might have came up short on that one. It's going to be fourth down with two to go. See what they're doing with it. First down coming. First down coming. Never mind. First down. For the comments, do you have to do a do a special shout out to Matt Exciter, doing a great job on the filming part. Oh yeah, to bring this to all of the cast and fans. Great kid, number sixty nine, Peyton Hendrick. He got pulled out there before this play, and he's one of the bigger guys on the team. And I do believe that the team calls him Shrek. Who's that again? Peyton Hendrick, number Peyton 69. Hendrick. He's a big guy. 310 pounds. Oh, man. Solid dude, then. Oh, Kate, yeah. oh. Big run. 35. Nice. Cole Rucker with the big chunk of yards. Just across the 50-yard line. line with another first down for the Comets. Great play by the Comets. Let's see, we got first down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49 yard line. And, oh, oh. they did, they tried to do that. And they tried to do that handoff toss again. Ephraim fumbling with the ball in his fumbled hands. again. Something that they haven't really gotten done that well this game, honestly. No. I mean, it's a handle what you can handle. And go from there for the comments. Conrad's coming back into the game, as you see. <laughs> Starting to catch a theme here between Conrad and Tate. Taking the wide receiving end. <sighs> First down with 16 yards to go. That was a huge loss for the comments. Oh, here we go. Brady Harmon's taking off running. Going for it. Stopped. Number 20, Brady Hartman, quarterback on the carry. Gets to the 50-yard line. line. Solid. Third down for the Comets. Third down for the Comets. Picked up. One yard to go for the Comets here on. 11 to go. 11, 11 yards to go here for the Comets. Ball on the 50 yard line. Cassins hike the ball. And off the Ephraim. Ephraim Mosquito with the huge, I mean, huge <laughs> chunk of run right there. Huge. Fourth down for the Comets. Fourth down for the Comets with four yards to go. Ball on the 44 yard line. This is going to be a huge play for the Comets. And as you see, KC is out of the game. He's taking a short break there, catching his breath. Say if they get a first down here, he will be back. He will be back in the game. Here we go as the comments line up. Fake handoff. Brady Hartman looking. Going for a pass. First down for the comments. The pass was complete to Ephraim and Mosquito. Ball in the 30 yard line. Football the Excellent play by the comments. Get them so, yeah. Gonna ask for anything better, honestly. No. Blake Albright's at the running back position right now. You got Ephraim Mosquito come running by. 
Uh, false Flag start. Up. I'll say, what was that? False start, you'd say? I'd Maybe. Call see what the ref says. Five yards is going to hurt him, but hopefully they got enough to make up for it. As we rear in a little over halfway through on the third quarter. Maybe first down, 15 yards to go now for the comments. Ball on the 35-yard line. It's such a beautiful night. I can't get over how nice it's turned out for the comments tonight, yeah. for everyone attending. Clear skies. Uh, Blake Albright, Blake Albright tough run there. Maybe got one or two yards, honestly. I mean, Blake's pretty a small kid, but he's really, he's a sophomore. He plays basketball, baseball, three-sport athlete. Um, pretty good kid. And he looks like he's coming out of the game, and Casey Alt's coming in, and Conrad is coming in. Coming, setting up here. Hopefully they'll pass here. Let's and see. they are Brady Hartman looking right. Ah, pass. overthrown. Oh. The a mosquito. A little bit of an overshot there by Brady Hartman, but it can be recoverable. Third down, 14 to go. Comments are huddling up, figuring stuff, fi figuring stuff out here. So, I bet they'll hand it off to Casey all. I mean, they're down 14 yards to go. They need something to get them those yards. And they hand it off to Ephraim Mosquito. Ooh, gets Ooh. a pretty good. 21, Ephraim Mosquito on the carry, which is across the 30 yard line, down to the 27. Down to the 27 yard line. Fourth down. Fourth down for the Comets. I'd give them with six yards to go. Six yards to go. I mean, Ephraim and Mosquito, like I said, he's a three-sport athlete also. He plays football right now. He plays wrestling in the winter, and he plays baseball in the spring. He's a senior. He's... He's 5'7", 155, so I mean, not that big of a kid, but he does do what he needs to do. Brady Hartman tried to rush in for some more yards. Kate Cowles coming back into the game. Comets did not seem to get to the first down, so Trojans taking over, turnover on downs. The Comets still leading six to nothing. Hopefully they can stay that way and keep the Trojans pushed back. I mean, the comments have them where they want to be. I mean, they got them set up already. Yeah. Which wasn't too bad. I mean, if they turned it over, they would have had it. I mean, either way, it was a good situation. So. Right. Looks like. Refs calling timeout. Timeout. Referee timeout. Timeout. With that ref times out, we're going to get back to you after a short little break here. Thanks for tuning in.
All right, and we're back. Timeout's over. Trojans got the ball, six to nothing. Comet's got to find a way to pull pull this out and keep pushing them back to secure themselves a win here. It looks like the Trojans lost some yards there. A good tackle by Zach Slocum to keep him pushed back, prevent him from getting yards. Number 44. Here we go. Trojans stop down there. The tackle made by Phoenix Singleton, number 52 and number 58, John Mitchell. They keep the Trojans back. Ball is on the 16 yard line. Third down with 16 yards to go. <laughs> 16 yards to go and the ball on, si on, on the 16 yard line. <laughs> Ball on 17, actually. They changed it. Correction there by the scoreboard keepers. Oh, they better get him. He, oh, get him, oh, get him, get him, get him. Trojans get him. making yards. Stops him. Oh, and it's going to be fourth down. Number 53, Trenton just barely getting them down. Fourth down with nine yards to go. Ball on the 24-yard line for the Trojans. Let's see if the comments can stop him here. This would be really huge for the comments right here to get this stop. Oh yes. Hunter K. Marr. Back to hunt for the Trojans. Blake Albright. Oh! Oh! Get him! Get him! Flag! Flag called Flags by the are out. I honestly do not know what would go on right there. I don't know. I didn't see anything. Myers run out of bounds by Welker. Trojans had an incomplete handoff. And we're stopped, thrown out of bounds, but we got a flag called, so we got to see what the refs are doing here. Comets take over the football. Comets will take over the football. That flag was declined by the Comets as they take ball on the 21-yard line. Excellent advantage point by the Comets here. I think they could pull off another score yeah. if they could just... They get a touchdown right here. I mean, that's going to give them a two-touchdown lead. I mean, they're going to be in good, good um, lead. Here we go, handoff. Casey all with the drive. Trojans are starting to get smart. They're starting to stop Casey on his runs, but I think he might be able to squeeze through him yet. Conrad comes back in for Tate Cal as Tate he Cal comes out and gets a good break. Catches breath. Flag was thrown. Looks like the flag was called on Comets. They're going to be pushed back five yards. Which isn't helping them at this point, but with being on the second down and only 10 yards to go isn't exactly hindering them either. It will be second down for the Comets with 10 yards to go. Ball on the 22 yard line. Casey Alt as the running back, Brady Hartman as the quarterback. Good duel right there. Hand off to Casey Alt. Casey Alt 
pushes, pushes. And he's down. It's going to be third down for the Comets. Ten yards to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. Third down for the Comets. Let's see what they can do here on third down. Oh, well, it looks like that's going to put it into third quarter. Thanks for tuning in. We'll be right back after a short break. And we're back, starting off the fourth quarter. Comet's still leading six to nothing. So far, the Trojans have been unable to push through the Comet's defensive line. Let's see how they stack up for the fourth quarter. Looks like a complete, like a complete pass by the Comets. Complete pass to Ephraim and Mosquito. Ball on the 11 yard line. They're taking a look at it. They're going to decide what they're going to see, what they're going to do. They're going to have an official timeout for a measurement. It looks like they're going to call a short timeout to check the measurement. We'll be right back here in a quick second. And we're back, and it looks like they're calling it just a few inches short, making it fourth down for the Comets. Fourth down, three inches to go for the Comets. Fourth down with three inches to go. Comets are rearing in real close. It'd be really great if they could get in another score here. Brady Hartman on a quarterback keeper. They're taking a look at it in there, seeing where he's at in the bottom of that pile. First down for the Comets. First down for Comets. 
ball resting on the ball. 10 yard line. Ball is resting on the 10 yard line. It'll be just short, but it can be a little past the 10 yard line. 11 and a half, 10 and a half. First and 10 for the Comets. First and 10 for the Comets as the ball is on the 10 yard line. This puts the Comets in an excellent position to score another touchdown. Let's see what they can do here. Here we go. Casey Alton has the running back, hands it off to Casey Alt. Casey Alt gets a good, maybe three, four yards right there. Ball's on the eight yard line. Down inside the 10 at about the eight yard line. Second down comments. We're in the second down in the comments. Eight yards to go. Hand off again to Casey Alt. Casey Alt. Picks up three yards right there, and the ball will be on the five yard line with third down to go. Slowly but surely, Comets are getting closer and closer to the end zone. Ephraim Mosquito is coming to the game for Blake Albright. I believe Brady Hartman, the quarterback, junior, I believe he is a two-sport athlete. Plays football now, and I'm pretty sure he, he does play basketball. I think that's it. I don't think he does anything in the fall. Not that I recall, no. I mean in the, the spring, spring, yeah, yeah. not Brady fall. <laughs> it's a good kid, a uh, hard-nosed kid. He weighs 180. I mean, he's 5'9". Not that tall, but he is pretty, pretty tough. Ball's on the five-yard line. Fourth down, five to go. Here we go. Helmets better pull something big here to get those yards. And ah, uh, he's getting back. Goes for it. In that situation, you cannot throw it. You throw it off to the side. You never throw it in the middle right there. Yeah, that's just throwing bait no, to the prey. That'll be turno turnover on downs. Back to the Trojans. Trojans health and comments, or is he? Conference between the officials on the field. Penalty flag now is thrown. Ref throws penalty flag. See what he's trying to call it out for here. Penalty is against the comments. Intentional grounding. Intentional grounding by the comments. And that's going to set them back. That was turnover on downs, wasn't it? I do believe, yes. Yeah. So even though, I mean, I think they're just deciding where the ball would be at yes. for the Trojans. Trojans will take over the football at the 10-yard line. line. 
Is that lightning or was that the light? Lightings. That was the lightings. Okay. Here we go. Trojans so far have not been able to best Caston's defensive line. Let's see how they fare. Ball will be on the 20 yard line. Take it down. 10 to go. 50. Huh? 50 on the reception for the Trojans. Casey Ol. Second down and a yard to go for the Trojans. Second down with one yard to go for the Trojans here. See if the Comets can stop them. And it looks like they get the first down. Center on the quarterback keeper. 22. Stop by 60. 66, Roger Clinton. 7, Tate Powell for the Comets. Trojans pick up the first down. Yes, and the Trojans do make the first down. But an excellent attempt in stopping them by Roger Flint and Tate Cowell. Roger Flint being about 5'9", 240 pounds, he's going to be hard to stop. That's why it makes great off play to the defensive line. Holding. That has to be a holding That's right there. That's got to be a holding right there penalty. 42 Ethan Berry on the carry for the Trojans. Penalty flag on the field. Holding against the Trojans. Yep. Holding against the Trojans. Yeah, that's going to play to our benefit right there. Sure will. Ten yard walk off against the Trojans. Sixteen. Sixteen. There he is. There, ooh, that was a close play right there. Almost, I think he had thirty-five. Thirty-five is Colton Walker. Colton Walker. I think if you would have maybe just dived out on that play, I think he might have had that interception. It was close. It was close. I mean, couldn't ask for any other better effort. I mean. Well, at least the pass was incomplete, which helps us. Second down with 16 yards to go. Man. Comets have to stop this passing rush. We're going to have to stop this pretty soon. Five. On the 30. Five yards to go. 30 yard line. Third down for the Trojans. Third down for Trojans. Five yards to go. Comet's got to pull something out here to be able to stop them. <laughs> I didn't even know you could put fifth down up there. Go as high as nine. Oh, oh, complete what a pass. catch by number one for the Trojans. Comments are, are going to have to figure something out here to be able to stop this passing. you got to be honest, they're yeah, making some pretty good pass yeah. plays over there, the Trojans. Now that was a good throw. There you go, Trojans. Hand off. And Quick. he stopped. Ooh, that was a hard hit. That was a hard hit. Two yards to go. 35. Ooh. Colton Walker reaches out and grabs. Trent Howard hit him pretty good at the end. He's going to be a little shaken up right there. Second down for the Trojans. Football at the almost 50 yard line. Number 21, Ephraim Amosquita got pulled out, seen limping off to the side. Good job. 
Trojans make another pass. It's caught. And stopped. That's going to be first down for the Trojans on the 30 on the 30 yard line. First down for the Trojans. Comments are going to have to really, you know, I think they need to call time and figure something out right here because they really need to stop this passing game. They need to figure out a new tactic here. The Trojans are making quite solid ground getting over into their end zone. Trojans make another pass. Nice. And he... That, that pass is complete. You no, know, be second down with two yards to go. Ball on the second down for the Trojans. Ball will be on the 22 yard line. Kevin's got to figure Ball something out here. Five minutes to go in the fourth quarter. We're getting down to the nitty gritty here. Let's see what the comments can do here. Come on. We're going to have to going stop for him. a pass. That's incomplete. Pass is incomplete. That's it. That Third down for Trojans. Third down for the Trojans. Two yards to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Cutting it pretty close here. They're going for the run. Quarterback oh. run. And he's getting and he's stopped. Number 53, Trenton Howard is able to put a stop to that rush and keep the Trojans back. First down for the Trojans. And that's going to be first down for the Trojans. Ball on the 20-yard line. Hand off play. Oh, he sees him. Number 52, Phoenix Singleton, is able to take him down. Ball's going to be on the 15-yard line now with five yards to go. Second down. Second and five for the Trojans. Zach Slocum gets taken out, number 44, to get replaced with number 77, Chris Smith. Trojans looking, looking for a pass. Looking for a pass. And he's taking off running, scrambling, and he's down. Fumble? Fumble. And Comets recover! Comets got the ball back. Comets get the ball back. John Mitchell. John Mitchell with the recovery. What a great play by the Comets. Seeing the loose ball, getting after it, jumping on the... The comments will have the comments will have the ball on the 13-yard line. First down with 10 yards to go. As we get down near the end of the fourth quarter, hopefully comments can pull out another score and seal the deal here on the game tonight. Three minutes to go. This this is going to be huge. Handoff play. I mean, key for the Comets is simply get first downs and just run the timeout. Seems the Trojans are being able, they're able to identify those running plays by the Comets. I think it's about time they try for a pass.
There we go, Comets going off. Casey rushes through to gain some yards. All Casey all on the carry. He's up to the 20 yard line. Third down. For it's going to be third down for the Comets with nine yards to go. Ball on the 20 yard line. Two yards to go. Two yards to go. Two sticks over there, and you can see the numbers. Handoff by the Comets is stopped by the Trojans. Refs calling timeout. We'll be back to you shortly after this quick little timeout. All right, welcome back. Fourth quarter, about two minutes left to go. Comets leading six to nothing. It's fourth down with two yards to go. Two go and ball on the 20 yard line. 52 Phoenix Singleton back to punt for the Comets. Phoenix Singleton, number 52, gonna go. Uh oh, gonna have to get that out. Oh. It's a high punt, doesn't get that far though. Looked like number 52 overshot it a little bit and is kind of flopped there a little bit over down there for the punt. Trojans will have the ball in the 36 yard line. Hopefully the Comets can keep him pushed back long enough for him to seal the deal with this game six to nothing. With a little bit over two minutes left to go. No Trojans handoff. Oh, he's cutting through the line. Oh no. Stopped. Casey Ald, number 40, just barely stops the Trojan rush to get to the end zone. First down for the Trojans. The Trojans then get first down. Officials calling timeout. We'll be back to you real quick right after this short break. Timeout over, we're back. Trojans looking. And they got a struggle over there. Snyder's handoff to Fletcher on the carry. And that was close. He's down to the five yard line. Second down, three yards Second to go. For the and ball resting at five. Ball rests the ball on the five yard line. With under two minutes left to go, Comets got to try and keep timeout. the Trojans away from scoring here. Comets. Timeout called by the Comets. We'll be right back to you after the short timeout break.
All right, folks, welcome back. We're getting started right up again with about a minute 20 left on the clock. Comets leading 6-0. to zero. Trojans getting real close to their end zone with about three yards to go. Struggle on the field. 42 is very the carry. the five. First and goal to go for the Trojans. Trojans make it first and goal. Ball on the two yard line. First down with two yards to go. Handoff play, and he's, oh, he what a play. What, what an easy defensive play by the Comets. Casey Alt gets right in there and takes him down. That'll push him back. That is, they will get backed up to the nine yard line. Trojans called timeout. We'll be right back to you. All right, welcome back. We're getting started again with under a minute left to go. Comets leading six to nothing again. They were able to push the Trojans back a few yards to be able to give them some breathing room. Let's hope they can keep them back. Well, and here goes Trojans looking for a pass. Incomplete! And that one for third down with fourth down. Now fourth down. Nine yards to go. Ball in the nine. Third down for the Trojans. Third down to go. Third down to go, excuse me on that one. Trojans looking for a pass, makes the pass. And complete! And that will make it fourth down for the Trojans with nine yards to go, ball on the nine yard line. Fourth down. It's getting real close here for the Comets. If we can keep them back for one more. On the field, called by the Trojans, their third and final timeout. Trojans calling their final timeout. We will be right back to you after this quick timeout. All right, we're back. Fourth down with under a minute to go. Comets have so far been successfully able to hold back the Trojans here. This crowd getting right behind the Comets as it gets really close here. Danger zone. Trojans going for, oh, scrambling. And complete, turn over on down. <clears throat> with... 36 seconds to go, and comments take ball. Now 
Official timeout on the field. Officials calling timeout to make sure all the players are. They seem to be good. Comet's getting ready to make a play. Under 40 seconds to go. Comet's taking the knee. And that'll do it. That'll run the clock out there. And Comets take the W. Comets win six to nothing. Comets. Great game. Six. The Trojans zero. Congratulations to both teams on a great game tonight. Thank you for turning in, tuning in to RTC TV4. Be sure to visit our website www.rtc4.com for more videos. Once again, I'm Galen Rensler here with Dakota, Dakota Hayden. We will see you next time on RTC TV4. Thank you.